I started it. It's recording. Thank you very much. Uh, Rogue Roy, what are we doing today? What is we this? are doing an Obe hot sauce. Okay. And this, they call it that. This was one of the things. Now, this is a Chesapeake Bay seasoning that goes on uh, seafood and all this stuff. And I've been selling a Chesapeake Bay sauce for uh, about a year now. And I actually went to McCormick. Okay. And I was like, hey, I'd like to sell your your seasonings and your uh, Jalisco, Jalisco sauce. Jalisco, yeah. I was like, I want to sell that on my, on my website. And I gave them a link to my website. Right after that, they come up with this. Oh, and I'm like, I was like, you know what? I don't want to have apophenia and like, you know, and like think that those things are connected. I kind of think those things are connected. So let's see if this tastes like my sauce, Oriental Shore. Okay. Okay. No, it tastes like uh, Old Bay seasoning in liquid form. It, it tastes like they took like a little bit of, of Frank's. Yeah. And just like put some Old Bay in it. And mix yeah. It up. That's pretty much what it is. All right. uh, yeah. It's not copyright infringement on my delicious Oriental Short, yeah. which tastes much, much better than this. Okay. So it's not, yeah, it's Old Bay. And I couldn't try this when it first came out because it was one of those like. Like the chicken sandwiches at Popeyes, it was one of those things that was just such a cultural thing that everybody ran out and grabbed it, and, and I didn't have a chance. I was like, forget it. I'll wait till it becomes more commonplace. So I found out one more. Yeah. Now that's good stuff. This I can Next. test. I have really good flavor for um, hot sauce. Now, how about this? Have you ever tried this? Uh, I have. I've tried this uh, noodles. This means. Uh, Bulldog, ex extremely spicy. Sorry, I just read it in English. But That's fine. Yeah. Well, my son could eat the noodles. Okay. Oh, he could eat the, the challenge? What challenge? The, the, the Samyang too ex spicy. It's not a challenge. It's, it's just, just, it's just, just eating a challenge. It's normal, just eating. It's normal food. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, let us try this. Yeah, you gotta be careful because that thing gets naked real quick. Like, because the bottle. And the way it's, okay, so I did actually translate this from Korean. It's written there. It's like, um, I, it says something like easy off wrapper for recycling. So it's a green company. If, they, if that's something that you care about, if you're conservationist like me, they care about that too at Samyang. So, okay. Yes. And they're also, fancy. they triple secure this stuff. It's yeah. in this tight knit container, covered and wrapped, and then they secure it with one of those. Grenade pin style, uh, yeah. Uh, yeah, this is uh, a bit of a challenge. Are your hands clean, brother? It is, but my nail is, uh, I can't even. There you go. I trust. I trust. Goodness. Oh my god. There you go. Alright. Alright. Mickey, it smells like new noodles. Alright. Now, this stuff, let me try to get. Uh, chicken, chicken lung. I'm doing. I'm doing a. Uh, La lung carbohydrate diet. Let's try. Let me warm up some pasta here just And I'm doing a taglish Saturday. So I'm trying to speak as much Tagalog as I know. <laughs> All right. Which is is I start a sentence in Tagalog and then I pronounce every English word. Uh, with the emphasis on the other syllable after that. All right, you got it in there. Oh my gosh, this is a lot. Okay, cheers, brother. Cheers. <laughs> I don't think I've ever done it just straight like that. It tastes good. Yeah, and it, it's it's very. Um, I was looking at the ingredients. It's something like. Like soy sauce that's in there, but it hits you like cinnamon, and I cannot figure out how that's possible. Not cinnamon, um, something sweet. Um, like what do you call that? Baby? Um, when you make your bulgogi, you put the um, like marin, marin sauce. Mm. Scary monster. That's <laughs> good. Okay. Okay. All right. She's reacting for me. All right. No, that's good. That's good. It's very, very, very spicy though. I definitely tried it. Did you say very, very spicy? Uh, you know, by by normal table standards. 
this dude is not a normal person. And I try to I remind him of that. Because he'll just like be like eating a ghost pepper like, oh. It's I, good. I thought it was a jalapeno. You know, mm. It's spicy. But uh, mm. not extremely spicy. Exactly. Um, it's spicy. It's yeah. yeah, it's definitely spicy. It's it's very tasty too. So, um, I mean, Mickey, the normal, the normal world thinks that it's challenge worthy. That's, that's how spicy it is. <laughs> Alright. Right. It's really good. It's very tasty. I like it. With chicken, it's good. No, it's really good. Like uh, the noodles. Mm -hmm. We have the noodles. Right here. It's really good. I love it. Supposedly, Shin Ramyun came out with a yeah, spicy version as well. So I'm looking forward to trying to get my hands on that. And uh, yeah, I think that's our hot sauce taste test. We tested Old Bay, mediocre. I mean, it's not bad. It's not bad. I think I'm gonna finish the bottle. But yeah, um, and you like this better, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. Here you go. And, and I love it too. It's very flavorful. Like all Korean sauces, it's not really keto. It has like two grams of carbs in a, in a, in a, you know, a small serving. No. So you gotta be careful how much you put on no, stuff. No. But it's a lot more keto than any other Korean sauce. Meaning, gojujang, anything like that, that has so much carbohydrates. It's, it's basically liquid uh, soybean paste. So this is not as bad. All right, go buy some of this. This. It's really good. Uh, still good deal going on mild time, which is the mild version of this. Obviously. What, I don't think I really need it. Sully'sHotSauceStore.com. Or you can find them on Amazon. Yes, Amazon. You can search Sully's Hot Sauce Store on Amazon. Uh, or you can go to Sully'sHotSauceStore.com and click the link in our website. That's right. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks so much.